very important. And I feel that. I'm flowing. Ah, so you feel this reaction. Boom, boom, boom. So, right, so you feel this reaction. Ooh, beautiful. Like, ah. bring it down more. Right. Trap is down, not up. Yeah, lock it. Boom, this is right. And this is right. Then you just lock my hand. Boom, I already got it. Right. Boom, I already got it.
coming off that hand. So remember, you got see the person is bigger than you. When you're using the lobster here, pulls it. Or balance is right. Right. Down, right? So you're pulling him down into your hand. Say he's a big guy. You need to pull him more into you. And he's got a good structure already. Right. right. So in other words, here, standard here, boom, I'm in a ring. Right. When I judge size wise, I have to adjust the hand. Boom. Bring right into it. Right. Okay?
18, back to the center. All right, so in other words, if he's a big guy, you don't want to go up. You want to go up. You want to keep yourself here. Let him adjust to you. You play your game. Your game is center line here. Your game is keeping at this range. He has to adjust to you. When he's adjusted to you, that's when you're controlling the game. All right? Let's try it. Now he has to adjust to me. You understand? So you do it, you should go in the raw around that. You're missing the line here. Okay, so what you do is you go here and boom, bring it back in. Stay, stay here. Now he has to adjust to me. If I keep going up, ah, right, his game is right here. Right. You understand? No, I bring him to me now. Then boom. Then he has to move to me. You understand? She, she go right here. A situation erupts. We don't get to this level right away. We gotta get there, alright? So you have a method of using your feet, moving forward, right? So he gets his hands up, I got my hands up, I'm gonna go here, boom, on the side here. Okay? So just away from this distance here, we quickly have to advance, right? So now he's moving, because Charlie never stands. Charlie is always constantly moving. So the timing changes. The timing, he stands still, I stand still. The timing is easy. Boom, I'm gonna get in. There's nobody that stands still. Trust me, I, I pull all the time. Everybody's constantly moving, which is good for me. Because now I, I'm moving with him. See, so yeah, I step on his feet. He doesn't go nowhere. Then, boom, I blast her into the center. A moving target is always gonna be moving. So that means you gotta tail the center. When you tail the center, you control it. Now when you're at this reach here, he moves anywhere he wants to move. I move with him. So you're constantly moving along with the opponent, but you're beating him to his point. So I'm crazy, this is it. I'm already here. See, when he moves again, I'm already here. He's having a move now. You understand? Because I know he wants to move. So I'm blasting this. Now I'm adjusting my body. See my body, I'm adjusting to the feet. Okay? So you automatically, when you're closing the gap, you're locking in the bottom. You're locking in here also. You're locking in this part here. Everything is locked. Now it's up to him which way he wants to go. I got him here. Now he wants to move. His main thing is to be rushing. Right? So now he wants to push. Boom! I extend my punch. Okay? Why not extend what you already have? His aim should be for here. My aim should be for here. <coughs> Alright? So everything is based on feeling. If you have him here and he goes to adjust and you go back to adjust, he's going to get you. Why lose what you have? If you have this, it goes to rush again, boom! Oh, oh. You understand? It depends on the situation. If you're this close, you're holding this hand, this hand is over here, right? If he tries to rush it from here, he can get it. But if he tries to rush, boom! He goes right into a punch, this way. I'm not going to hesitate. You pull this into the punch, and then, bam, smash the elbow, right on this part. This whole structure dies right there. You understand? But you gotta learn how to flow. You, you, you get scared, it takes you. If you relax, you take care. Alright? So let's try to now use a way of countering. Use another way if you put it to this knee. Boom! Just use your feet to close the gap. The way you use your feet to close the gap is simple. Feet wide. Now you're good. Now you're inside here. Alright? So using the chunk you level, but you go from here and you're closing in this way. So that means my turn. Boom! See? Boom! Now you gotta control. Alright? So let's try to use that and flow with each other. That means that if I'm over here and he's struggling to move me forward, I'm not going to use this to hold him. Okay? If he wants to move forward, he can move forward now. I just turn my angle, hit, hit. Okay? If I'm over here again, he's moving forward in this way. Okay? So he's coming forward, he's like, bam, I'm going to go to the side. Okay? And then, bam, get him there. Okay? If I'm in this angle, he tries to rush me that way, get out of the way. Boom. Boom. You see? Here. Boom. Boom. You're constantly turning. Okay? Depending on your level. Fighting is moving a little bit straight. Now we get past the I go to the side. Okay, I'm over here. He rushes, moves. I go to the side here. Jump you up. Hey, boom. So you're always constantly moving. If you feel too much force, go around the force. Okay, he's busting my hip. Go around the force. So we boom, go around the force. Go face the force straight up. Okay, let's try it. Quality, I'm possessed. Don't say I'm fresh. When my voice goes through the rest of the mic, perform that I am holding. Stay off my back or I will attack and you don't want that.